What's going on, everybody? My name is Austin. You are back in Burgify Gaming, and we are here with uh, the Interrogation Chamber Amazing Binaural 3D Sound Play. Uh, basically, um, I'm supposed to listen to it, and, uh, you know, that's about all I know. Uh, this is actually a suggestion, uh, su suggestion. Uh, suggestion from a friend of mine, um, not Brian. Almost all his, all his ideas are bad, so... Uh, um, y'all can't see me, it's literally just gonna be me reacting to this. So, uh, let's see what they got for me here. Media Lab presents the interrogation chamber. Is that right? You will soon hear a play in binaural 3D sound. Please note that this purely fictional play contains some pretty scary and violent scenes. Do okay. not listen to it if these things can be bad for you. <laughs> We're gonna start there. That's awesome, all right? <laughs> Hearing the 3D sound effect is easy. You just have to put on a pair of earphones. Make sure that you put on the one marked R on your right ear and the one marked L on your left ear. Yes. For full effect, close your eyes, turn off the light and screen, and relax. I can't turn off the screen, but I'll turn off my lights. We'll turn the lights off. I can't show off my screen, so I'll just close my eyes. I guess it says on the screen, so put on your phone, keep your head still, and relax, close your eyes. Ugh, hope y'all can see me, because it's about as good as it's going to get, so, I mean, whatever. Good luck in the interrogation chamber. Alright, here we go. Who is that? So All right, you were awake? No. The lucky thing that you live. What's going on? But you won't stand the torture that is yet to come. I'm getting tortured? <laughs> Just oh, I guess interrogation you chamber. Don't say a word. Alright, so I'm keeping my eyes closed. I got my hand on space bar so I can pause and talk about this. Um, interrogation chambers haven't been a thing since like I don't know. I mean I guess with like like the Geneva the Geneva Convention kinda of stops everybody from like torturing people. But I don't know if this is like pre Geneva Convention or is this one of those countries that don't follow it, so. Shut up, you filthy Hungarian scum. My Hungarian? You're lucky to be alive in the Soviet Russia, who would feed you to the bears at least two days ago. Russia follows the Geneva Convention, I believe. Americans don't even know how to torture people anymore. So I'm in, am I in Russia or am I in fucking America and we're just torturing people? So I, know, I know America follows the Geneva Convention. Actually, hold on. I can shut this off. Oh, but then you can't see me. Oh, okay. Instant regret. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry about that. All right, so this is gonna stay on, I guess. Um, okay. Anyway, back to it. I do not pay you to make insightful comments, Bruno. Hi, Please. Bruno. Assume your position in the corner. Are you Dr. Traeger? No, I'm right. While well, I attend to our new guest. Hi. Stop good. that. You are awake. Stop that. Good. good, 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 good. I have been wanting to speak with you for quite some time now. Yeah. Hi. My, my, my. So How are the mighty fallen? Bet you didn't expect to end up like this, huh? No. You have been down here a long time. Have I? You must be parched. I am. Where's my drink? Let me get you some water. Where's my drink? And it's gone. It's bottled, but what can you do in this country? A bottle's probably safer. Unfortunately, there is only enough for me. No. Oh. But you asshole. <laughs> tough guy. I am. I'm gonna take a lot of shit. They put you guys through my. Yeah, who camp sucked? Delicious. Take like Bruno here, for example. His training for like in Russia involved killing bears. Is that what really goes on over there? Holy fuck! With my bare hands. Are you wearing leather? Well, to be honest, I still have to figure out exactly which training you went through. To that end, who do you work for? The U.S. Navy? Science, eh? Well, I did not really expect you to answer that question. 
Oh, I did. What's it, Eddie? Are there ways to make people talk around here? Bruno has brought some toys back from the old country. I swear Bruno's wearing leather. My, uh, that is gruesome and painful. Well, I can't see Bruno, it, so. You really have outdone yourself this time. Thank you, boss. I uh, shall not partake in this gruesome and barbaric business. I need that to show from Detroit. Bruno, <laughs> open the case, will you? Show from Detroit. Okay, boss. I mean, I keep there. Who knows? Not paying you for this. No, <laughs> you rape the pair with hands. <laughs> what the fuck? Hello, Sean. I'll elect the cage. It's bigger than the last one. Alright then. Hi, Sean. No, no, no. Make sure our guest stays alive. You know how she is. Yes, boss. I'm good. So this is a guy? Yeah. Hi, Sean. Ain't much of you. Boy, I'm a small guy. Always been. You're the silent type, right? Nope. I've been talking the entire time. I'm all silent in the beginning. Nope. Like my wife. But they're what? all silent in the end. Like my wife. What the fuck? So we've got some toys here. I like toys. Dodos and everything. They're fun. I play sword fighting with them. It'd be an awesome video doing dildo sword fighting. Like, comment, subscribe. You want to see dildo sword fighting with me and Brian? Let me see. Oh, nice knives. I have two knives. Oh, don't do that. That's bad. Ugh. Do that. I need to talk to my fans. I'm gonna cut your ear. That's fine. Leave my dick alone, though. Not in my ears. But first, I'm gonna cut your hand. All right. I don't know why, but okay. <laughs> you thought that the first thing that I was going to do was to stab you? I mean, depending on where. No. I like to play with my food. Alright then. Cannibal Hector over here. Speaking of food. There's a cheese grate down here. Alright. Oh. You hear the sound of that sweet I don't baby? like it. Oh yeah. I mean, That's loud. Um, well, maybe a cheese grate would be too... Uh, Juicy? No, no, too juicy, yeah, too juicy. Try something gay. No, I know. A saw. What about a saw? You know what a saw is? A saw? I don't know what a saw is. I don't know my father knew what a saw was. He's a working man. I taught him. Oh, never mind then. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Hang on a second. Alright. Hey, Sean. You screamed enough, haven't you? Yes, I have. Yes. No, no, no. Not in that way. You don't. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. You gotta rape him too? You see the light? Oh. You must oh. die. Oh. oh. Real quick, I've had bad flashbacks to. Uh, I lost whistleblower with uh, Frank Manera, the the cannibal guy. If those for those of you who haven't seen it, you should watch it. But for those of you who uh, don't care, don't watch it. But that's what this reminds me of. <laughs> the hell? My volume's all the way up, so it's gonna hurt if it's right in my ear. The right tool. The right tool for you. Is that what much? Why do you need a saw? Ow. 
loud. Wait a second. I smell bacon. Bacon? I like bacon. DPD! Man, I gotta get out of here. What about that white? I think Sean died. No. You gotta get out of there, right? Yeah, it was Sean. Sean died. I don't run from police. Police run from me. Well, yeah, you killed a bear. Well, Sean raped a bear, so. Don't do that. Alright, well, that was it, and that was kind of creepy, but, uh, you know, this is kind of fun, so there's probably a, a lot more stuff that I do with, I think it's called ASMR, so, uh, yeah, expect more of this. This was kind of fun. A little short video, so I hope you all don't mind, um, but yeah, so, as always, if you like the video, please like, subscribe, if you have suggestions, gameplay tips, comments, put in the comment section below, and I will see you all in the next episode.